other night As I lay sleeping Oh, I dream I hear Hello everyone, this is your friend Smokey Valor here I wanted to introduce you to somebody very near and dear to my heart Her name is Arlene and she is a nurse. Now let me give you a little history here. Arlene, I must gush a little. Forgive me, darling. Arlene used to travel with Bob Hope and the USO to us. He was, she was his personal nurse. Personal, that's another story. She's writing an autobiography. She's giving away all the juicy details. It's gonna be very, very, very naughty. Isn't it, Arlene? Mm -hmm. You're such yes. a naughty girl, aren't you? Yes, yes. That's why I love her. She's just yes. naughty. So, let me oh, fix this I know camera. all about Bob Hope. Ooh, tell me. Just one, one, one thing about Bob Hope that everyone has always wondered about that hunk of man. Ooh, let me think. One little dirty oh. detail. Well, it's been so long ago, I have to think a little bit. She likes to pretend that she doesn't remember. Yeah, yeah. But she always tells me, I remember, I just want people to buy the book. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> She's great. <laughs> I should stop smoking. Ooh, well, I'm sure glad. I didn't say must I did, hello. Awful. Must have been awful before you tried to stop. You know, I really don't care for this angle. It makes my head look ginormous. You look mm -hmm. so thin. How do you stay so thin? Ooh, on I stay on a diet. What is your diet, Arlene? Oh, a seafood diet. And what is that? That's, you eat everything you see. Oh, but a boom <laughs> The old USO jokes never die, folks. So, she's forgetful. That's, this is not in the book, though. She forgot her ginkgo this morning. Hello? Yes, yes. You have to read the book. She's confused there. Have you eaten today? Is your blood sugar low, darling? I think so. So tell me, when did you change this? You change your hair color to this fabulous new shade oh, I'm hue of trying, pink. I am trying to stay up with Joan Evan, Joan Rivers. Joan Rivers. Joan Rivers. Oh, yes. Joan Rivers. Yes, you know. Well, just like Joan Rivers, she too's had a little work done. Yes. She's actually 130, but she's really preserved. Need, I don't really need all the work that Joan gets, but. Uh, she's modest, folks. Yes. Very modest. Yeah, I don't need all that stuff. Hello. Isn't she wonderful? So tell me, Arlene, what's your favorite childhood memory? Oh, I said I can't remember my childhood memory too well either. Oh, save it, darling. It's not in the book. Share something. <laughs> oh, let me think. You ask all these questions right off, you know, that I don't, uh, not prepared to answer. What, is it sorted? I mean, did something bad happen? I mean, did they leave you out on the side of the road? Yes. Did you have to I eat possum left, sandwiches? Yes, I was left out beside the road for a while, and I thought for a long time that the buzzards might have hatched me, but... Uh, really? The jewelry, oh, I don't wear jewelry when I wear this, because... Uh, well, this what are those things hanging fashion. from your ears? Oh, <laughs> I do wear the earrings, but this, I don't need anything around my neck because I wear this to be, be pretty. Mm-hmm. Let's get a little closer look at us, because we are pretty wonderful. Yes, we are very beautiful. You owe everything. I think your eyes are very gorgeous. And you oh, know. that is such a damn yes. cop out. Yes. Your yes. eyes are nice. It's like saying to somebody when you're trying yeah. to fix them up with a fat, ugly girl, she has a great personality. <laughs> oh. I mean, you should have just told me I had a great personality. Hello, and then I'd have to bitch slap you. <laughs> <laughs> the hair is just beautiful, too. My hair? Your hair. Your ha right. hair is just beautiful. My, I love that color. My facility Your color and my color are just so beautiful. Well, you know, I was very upset the first time she did it because I was like, oh my God, I'm now a blue hair. Yes. But then I embraced it. I was well, like, make it a little more lavender. Yes, it's lavender. And mine is pink. A little lipstick on my teeth, you know? Mm -hmm. So who does your nails? You have big lips, so. Well, you know, it, well, it made me very popular with the men growing up. I oh, never, yes. I was never at a loss for a man. I'll bet not. Unfortunately, it didn't attract the right kind of men, hello? Which explains my fourth <laughs> marriage. What? Yeah. I love my Arlene. Let me share with you a memory about Arlene. You know, one time, this is back during the Depression, you know. I know we look young, but we, would, we actually lived through the Depression. Yes. So we had this bright idea that we was going to rob a bank. Unfortunately, we got there, we had masks on, we wore our bumps, we were trying to throw them off because they thought female bank robbers back then didn't exist. Basically, we get to the bank with our high heels on, 
our very, very nice, our favorite potato sex. And we had taken a magic marker. Actually, it was charcoal. We didn't have any magic markers. We were broke. We did a money sign on it because we thought it would be very nice. A little extra touch. As you can tell, we like embellishments. We like to add things to our ensemble to make it a little special. You know? Right? Mm-hmm. So, we go into the bank. We have these great plans. And we say, stick them up! So they did. We go into the safe. Nothing but dust balls. Dust balls. Rolling all around. There was no money. Arlene, really, this is not your mirror. I mean, really. <laughs> Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Are you really fixing your hair while I'm telling a very, very touching story? I'm listening to your story. I mean, this is story. a memory we share. I'm, I'm listening to the memory. You're not listening to anything. I remember going to that bank. Yes, trying to steal the money. If you want her to listen, you have to talk about her. <laughs> Otherwise, she tunes out and starts primping Hello. <laughs> I need a smoke. Do you have a smoke, Arlene? Did no, you stop I'm smoking again? Yeah, well, I'm trying to stop. Well, that explains why you're such a bitch. Yes, that's <laughs> it. <laughs> I wish you had one, but I, I, I probably do need one, but you know. This, but it probably must have your lipstick, though. I'm a little low on lipstick, and I don't yes. want to. But enough about me. What do you think of me? Oh, I think you're gorgeous. <laughs> you're just absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> I think we're both gorgeous. We are pretty wonderful. Yes, we are. We're both just plum, I mean, pretty really, beautiful. You think that we drank formaldehyde every morning? Yes, we probably could. You didn't fish tell them about bank, robbing the bank. Well, hello, darling. You were there. Oh, but Why I don't know, you finish you the story? Telling, you act like you don't you, remember anything. We're talking about you. You, you should love telling, to talk. But you were telling the audience about robbing the bank. I think, she bought, took, yeah, you I think she had a, I think she had a mini, another mini stroke no, towards no, no, the end of the story. Did the left I side go he, numb? I think he forgot to tell you about the bank. Well, they had no money. What else is there left oh, to tell? Other no, than the fact that we stood there like assholes holding bags in our high heels. <laughs> well, what's the other one's name? The short one with the gimpy leg. With this, oh, oh, that one must have, we must have called him Shorty. Shorty, that's yeah, right. Yeah, that was a good name for him, Shorty. That's right, I remember Shorty. Yeah, yeah. He liked he wore, to sing, too. And he wore orthopedic shoes. I remember he had that one shoe that had the sole that was a lot bigger than the other uh -huh. one. It looked like he Frankenstein on one side. He still wears that shoe. Uh -huh. Has that thing growing out the back of the back, you know. What, he still we has the hump? Money. Yeah, no, it's more of a gross on his back that comes up to his neck. Oh, know, God. That sounds painful. Yeah, but he's very, everybody really likes him, though. He's got a good personality. Oh, my God. Good oh, personality again. That means that, he's ugly. Yeah, he's got that good personality. Probably a little chubby, too. Yeah. <laughs> good personality. Oh, you remember that song we used to sing together? Oh, sure. Sing it with me. It had to be you. You remember it? Yeah, I it remember some of it. Had to be you. you. It had to be you. I wandered around. She forgot the words. Finally found somebody who could make me be feel blue. blue. Could make Take it, Arlene. me feel true. I Take it, Arlene. I don't know, and I have. Forgot. I don't remember. It you yeah. remember how we used to hang out at the shipyards in Jacksonville, Florida, looking for strong, strong men? Oh, yes. And strong Brunswick, smelling sometimes. In Brunswick, Georgia, too. Really? Ooh. Whatever happened to Leroy? I remember that. Whatever happened to him? Happened to him? Oh, he's out of the picture. Well, what happened? Did he run off? Did he go back to his wife? He went back to somebody. I don't know who he went oh, to. Oh, that's awful. Is that lipstick on my chin? Do I have a rash? <laughs> oh. Well, at least it's on the chin and not down there, you know? <laughs> you remember when that happened? Thank God for penicillin. <laughs> we right up. You're a crazy woman. A little Lotrimin and penicillin. Foxy, you a crazy foxy woman. So you have a big time job. Well, I wouldn't say big time, but you know, I have nothing really that clever to say about it. Get back in character. This is Smokey and Arlene. We're signing off for now. Signing off. Thank you so much for yes. your time, Arlene. We it love was, you. It was Bye -bye. so good to see you again. Good to see you too. I don't want to smudge my lipstick. Ooh. Don't think we love us. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>